What is up, guys? Welcome back to another Let's Play Eleanor. Uh, whoa, that got really bright. So, we last left off on the Golden Butterfly. Um, we were talking to that 15 year old, and then we arrested her daddy. So, I'm not exactly sure we have to go now. I think we have to go to the police station to question this guy. But, I guess we'll check now. Let me check. Um, but yeah. Oh no, actually, we're going to the Belmont High School. I forgot about that one. Um, it's been a few hours since I last played. I was studying, so I definitely got my mind, my mind off of this game. Uh, but anyway, let's go to the Belmont High School. That is where, um, supposedly the killer's uh, daughter goes to. Uh, I don't remember what was exactly we were going to do there. <gasps> oh my god, look at this car. I feel like I have never driven it. See if it stops, so I can like steal it. And this audio, what the hell is it doing? No, 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 no! You're not going anywhere. You gotta be kidding! We're driving this. Yeah, we are. Because I've never driven this car. I know I have never driven it. Ha! I knew it. Buick, Buick ambulance. All right, you can have your ambulance back. I just needed to get it in. That's it. <laughs> oh crap! A lot of people, a lot of people, a lot of you send me messages while I'm recording, um, like with the subject boss or like what's up YouTube. Um, I wish it could appear in the video, but sadly my face cam is in the section of the screen where all the messages appear. So I'm sorry about that. I should have thought about it when I first started the series, but why won't Floyd get in my damn car? This guy. Get in! The heck is wrong with this guy? Come on, get in the car! You better get in. Oh, there we go. Dumb glitches, my god. Anyway, I just wasted a ton of time there. I'm surprised, you know. I didn't make the husband. Always make the husband. I'm sorry, I got distracted by the dialogue. I don't know why that's been happening so much. I guess I'm uh, a little more into the story than I've been all the entire series. So, yeah, this shirt makes me look like I have um, thick, like shoulders. I don't. It's just a huge shirt. That's all. All right, here we are. Um, I don't know where I'm supposed to stop. How's that go? Belmont High School. It's the first season since Fabergasting's over. We have to go. I told you I can't Saturday. I'm busy. Busy where? Oh. You're going on another drive with Jamie Gardner, aren't you? What the hell is? That looks like the guy in the uh, killing scene. So I don't know if it was actually the daddy or if it just the daddy recruited another one of these dumbasses to kill the wife. I don't know. But I guess I could say the um though the like the females haven't really changed much like their accent and stuff they were like but they they had that LA accent so I don't know if that's actually how they talk I gotta ask my grandma actually I don't know because my grandma didn't really grow up in the US so neither did the the my both oh my god I've never gotten to that vehicle I have to go back after I tackle this guy of course so Right in front of the avenue thing in the mini map. Let's see if I can remember. Come on, come on, come on. I forgot to tackle him. Oops. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. You fucking me. Oh god, no. I did not just say that. Oh my god, this guy's so far. What the heck? Oh no, I have to fight him now. I don't remember how to fight. There we go. That's how I fight. Well, that was really easy. 
Ooh, that was really easy. Eleven K, go ahead. Eleven K, see the janitor. A green nineteen forty six coupe registered to a Mrs. Hugo Moeller has been found in the parking lot adjoining the Belmont High School and playing fields. Eleven K code two. What? It was found there her vehicle, but I have to find that truck though. What's your name? Who's asking? We can do this the easy way or the hard way. Name's Eli Rooney. Been in trouble with the law before, Eli? Some. What are you doing around here? I like to keep an eye on the show. Strictly paternal, is it, Eli? Oh, Jesus, we got a. A woman was a last night, Eli, and murdered. And I would love to make you for that, you low key motherfucker. But I wouldn't know nothing about that. A woman, you say? I like them a little younger than that. Turn out your pockets, Eli. Oh, Lord. Because I'm about to break your fucking skull. This floor is going head on. Oh. You're under arrest, Eli. You're in very deep trouble. Then. Get some backup down here, Rusty. We need to get this. Now I'm confused. Down. Was it the husband or was it this dipshit? I'm so confused. A butterfly thingy, whatever. No, I wanted to get in that truck! A truck I found while I was chasing this dip crap. Ha, <laughs> crap dip. What time did you see the person park the car? Late last night, after school social, maybe 1 a.m. If I keep it a good eye out lately, he'd had problems with the child molester. Eli Rooney. You've met him. Filthy son of a bitch. He was here yesterday before the dance. Was it him you saw park the car? I don't know, sir. I'd like to say yes, but the truth is, it was pretty dark. Would you say Rooney is violent? Yes, sir. I would say so, yes. Thanks for your help. Whoa. Now I'm confused. I don't know if it was the dad or if it was this guy. Anyway, before anything, I want to get into this car. If I could. Oh, wait. Is this clue time? Yeah, the clue music is on. Oh, this is the part I was talking about in the last episode that I got confused and I didn't know, like, what to do. But what you have to do is, I think you have to inspect this, yeah, you have to inspect this car's trunk. And as you can see, this is all the stuff used to, um, kill the lady. So, yeah, I hope I saved a lot of you time because... Hugo Mahler. I wonder what Eli does for a living. I'm so confused. Uh, whatever. Anyway, then there we got the crowbar. Or no, that's not a crowbar. Um, that's a. I don't know what's called in English. I'm sorry. A blo uh tire iron. Yes, that thing. Um. Right. So we got our killer. Pretty much. It's pretty obvious. And that's it for all the clues, and hopefully, I'm going to go ahead, and I'm going to find that freaking, wait, can I get into this car? Because I, I would like to, no, I can't. Alright, here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to grab this car, and I'm going to take it, oh my god, this car is actually really nice. Must be some preppy car, and I've already gotten in it. So here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to go to that location where we followed Eli and I'm gonna find wait wait where did he even go it wasn't through here he got into here and then oh wait I think after that we went through those stairs Somebody's calling me. Anyway, we went through these stairs, and then I'm retracing the steps here. Ah, screw this! I don't remember. <laughs> this car is really nice, though. 
Oh, but that truck, I've never gotten in it. Let's see if I can get in it. Which I'm... We're not driving this, oh my god, come on. Yes, I knew it! Oh my god, I'm actually only, only missing 14 vehicles. How sweet is that? Oh my god. This vehicle takes a whole football field to do a U-turn. Anyway. Going back to our beloved vehicle. Oops. Um, I wasn't gonna hit a citizen. I was gonna hit that car. There's a total difference. Alright, um... Where's my car? My police car. Which definitely isn't that one. How many... Oh my god, how many cop phones is there everywhere? Oh my god, this car. This car. I've never gotten in it. I've gotten in it. Um... Come on, where did I leave that be? Where did I leave the freaking police car? Well, it must be out here. That's that cop. That's that cop. Well, I can't find my car. So that's great. Let's just call, uh, whatever it's called. Batch 47. How can I help, detective? I need interrogation set up at Central for both suspects being held in the Mahler homicide case. Certainly, detective. I'll get in touch with the watch commander. All right. So I need to find that police car. Where the hell did I put that car? It's nowhere in here. Wait, right, so I decided to just take this one instead. Because <laughs> I couldn't find pass, mine, man. so screw it. If I see a police car... I don't know oh, here's one. My gut says I'll just take this one. Because it has the same functions as our normal detective one. And sorry if I get so distracted with the um, dialogues. The They're just so interesting. I'm literally tempted to not talk during those dialogues because I, I'm, they're just really interesting. I really want to hear them, and I hope you guys understand. He's a peeper, Rusty. We can pick him up for something else. Really want to run that risk? And, uh, uh, I saw that singing. Please don't judge. Uh, Yes, I'm a professional whistler. Alright. This audio is really loud. I'm having a lot of trouble with the audio. I don't know why. Um, anyway, so I'm heading I was to the center police station. And I believe we're going to be questioning both of those guys. Uh, both the daddy and the crazy uh, pedophile. So, it should be pretty interesting. I'm really hoping that I don't, like, fail miserably like I did with the daddy. Oh, my nose itches. So, yeah, wish me luck on that. Here we are. Watch where you're driving, you maniac! Central Police Station. I don't know what is it with my eyes. I'm always, like... Anyway, let's... Go soft on me here, oh, you're saying that I failed? Oh my god, no. Felt, leave him be. Are they ready? Molars in two and the perverts in one. Get in there and get a <laughs> conviction. <laughs> Alright, so... Captain, uh, we were on our way to interview Eli Rooney. Yes, folks, I know. This particular... I have tried to reaffirm his belief in the wrathful and terrible God. Whichever way it goes, I will be first. Okay. Looks like Chief is going to be heading to El Eli's room. Who the hell is this? You look like you've had it rough. Oh, that's Eli. You see me asking for your sympathy, boy? 
Oh, looks like you got beaten up by a little somebody. Somebody. Right, place of employment. You down on your luck, Eli. I have work. My family ain't roadkill during the dust bunny. But you have a job. A parolee has to have a job, correct? I had me a job down in San Pedro. I'm looking for something new. What did he say? Because I wasn't paying attention for like two seconds. Um, but you have a job. A parolee has to have a job, correct? I had me a job down in San Pedro. 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 <laughs> I'm looking for something new. Uh, that's a lie because I found the uniform on his trunk. I don't know. This is a tough one. This yes. Place you work have a name? Hennessy Marine. You can't misplace big yellow letters HM out front. They give you any work wear, Eli? <laughs> sure. Green cover on. Dang thing was hot, fella got back in the pen there. Back in penitentiary. Penitentiary, yes. Access to braided rope. Did you ever tie up any of your victims, Eli? It's not a nice thing to go calling that. What would you call them? I can't say. Why? I learned a long time ago not to go talking about the things I like. Talking about it just seems to give people a damn trouble. Answer the goddamn question, Rooney, before I brain you. See what I mean? Short answer is yes. Do you have any preference regarding rope, Eli? I know a good rope from a bad rope, if that's what you mean. This was definitely the killer. That's not what you mean, is it? Any old rope will do me fine. I think it's truth. Yes. Well, this is actually really easy because it's kind of obvious that he did it. Um, yeah. You killed Mrs. Muller and stole her jewelry. That ain't so. Ain't done nothing like that. It's a lie. You're a liar, Eli. You needed the money, so you killed What her. money? He didn't steal. I've been around, <laughs> son, son. You got some evidence that proves I stole that butterfly? Oh, you? my God. I took the butterfly from this guy right in front of him. He can't be kidding me. I done told you I found that pretty thing. I never stole it. What? I don't like you, Eli. I think you're an evil man. I think you try to pass off your pain to other people. I can't make you for this case. But my consolation is that I don't think you will be out of prison for very long. Didn't count on it, shit bird. By the way, Eli, the captain and the hat squad would like to talk to you next. Any idea what they might want to talk about? I thought I got it right. My he money, said the butterfly thing. I have to show him the evidence. evidence is solid. I think it's time we hit him. No, no, no. I still have to talk to that other guy, though. What is this? No guns lying inside this door. Where's the other guy? Oh, sweet. <laughs> uh, well, where's the daddy? The hell? Okay, okay. Floyd said something. What was it? Rusty Gallo. No, that's not it. What the f where am I supposed to go? I'm supposed to interview this guy. This other guy. The, the dad. Where is he? Yes, I am the cop. Carter Gordon. What the heck? The frick is this? Oh, screw it. I'm getting out of here. I can't find these pendejos maybe he's um 
around here. Oh, here, here, here we go. Interview here. room two. I knew it. Here's where we stand, Hugo. Your next door neighbor heard screaming coming from your house. You were burning your blood-stained shoes. You have no one who can confirm your whereabouts last night. Your daughter says you're a violent man. We have everything we need to send you to death row. And all you have to say for yourself is, I didn't do it. I swear I didn't kill him. Give me that lie test. I can prove it. <gasps> oh, my God, guys. He has four questions. Let's do the institution point trophy. Let's do it. Let's do it. Why did you burn your shoes, Hugo? Because I knew you'd never believe me. Um, let I'm I'm using the institution. What? Are you kidding me? Well, what do you mean connecting? I need to ask the community so I can use this. What? The, what? It says it's connecting. I'm gonna wait for it because I need to get this trophy. I shall wait. Maybe if I move my PlayStation. Why? Why are you just sitting there? Uh, uh because I am. Why is this crap not connecting? Guys, I'm gonna have to forget it because it doesn't want to connect. I turned off every single thing that could be possibly stealing the Wi-Fi, and I don't know. So. Uh, I'm so sorry. I'm gonna have to continue. So yeah, let's just... What was it that he said? Why did you burn your shoes? Because I knew you'd never believe me. I, I don't know what what's that supposed to mean. And I'm trying to freaking do this and a uh, stupid crap. Um, um, in that case, doubt. God damn it, I got it wrong! Or do we have to take it out of you in lumps? Do it your best shot. I can take whatever you throw. I mean, God damn it. I'm sorry for raging hard. Uh, I don't like raging hard. Do you know anything about ropes, Hugo? As much as the next man. I, I was a scout. I run some more in the army. God you know damn it. Rated rope? Some. Uh, they're mainly used for, um, Mooring lines, hawsers, you know, that kind of stuff. We don't have much use for them in the machine shop. We use chain hoists. Why am I such a failure sometimes? Holy crap. <sighs> um, victim's vehicle. We found your wife's car. Someone parked it at the school late last night. Do you have anything to say about that? It wasn't me. Where do you keep your work clothes? I keep them at work in my locker. Um, I think that's a lie. Enough lies, Hugo. Your overalls put you at the scene of the crime last night. My overalls are in the laundry of my house. No, they weren't. They were in the trunk of the car. Thank you. Blood stain yes. with the initials H M found in the trunk of your wife's car. They can't be mine. Why, Hugo? Because if they were yours, they'd be in the incinerator too. Yes. Access to tire iron. Your wife was beaten with a tire iron, Hugo. An appropriate choice of tool for a mechanic. I know nothing about any tire iron. Are you kidding me? You're lying, Hugo. You're gonna have to come clean on this. You got no proof. I found a tire iron. Um. Yes, I got it right. Hugo. What make of car do you drive? Uh, 
Chrysler Airflow. So I guess that explains why the tire iron that killed your wife came from a Chrysler. Huh. I think it was him. God damn it, I don't know what to do! Stupid music, I don't know what to do. I'm gonna charge him. Hugo Muller, I'm charging you with the murder of your wife. You'll be arraigned and taken before a grand jury. Book him, Rusty. With pleasure. Yes. Even though that was a complete fail with the institution points. But next time, I will get th that trophy. Pretty quick. I have to say I'm disappointed. I stood in front of a troop of reporters and made promises. Promises of swift and fearful retribution, and you bring me an armful of vagary and happenstance. You made the department look bad, lad. Do it again, and your career as a policeman will come to an abrupt and ignominious end. You two are back on the streets. Find street criminals, rouse them, beat them, and restore some fervor to your police work. Case will come and revive my faith in your abilities. Are you serious? What 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 just happened? What just happened? I found almost all of the clues. Um uh, poor Michelle. And I got like three stars? I don't know. God damn it. I wish I could do better. Flashbacks, here we go. Belt! We captured two regular army. Lieutenant! Belt, we've been over this. That sniper barely missed you back on the beach. Until the mission is over, there'll be no more saluting or signs of brain. I'm in charge here, Medier! Do you wish to interrogate the prisoners? How wasn't he headshot yet? With his head like clear for those well, beat. Koreans or whatever they, they so were. Sullen. Wondering why we haven't killed them yet. There is no greater shame than being taken prisoner. Yet this golden boy actually seems to know what he's doing. Not because the nose high so tall. Not my own. None of the good. Yeah, you know, you know, I wish I could do that. Yeah. Kiss him, man. None is some dato. Umutarunda. See that boy? He slapped that Jap right upside the head. It was merely to remind him of his place. His shame was the tone of voice that he used with a superior. I respect the Japanese, Corporal. Respect, we're here to kill the sons of bitches. You know why we are fighting the Japanese, Private? With respect, sir, these bastards attacked Pearl Harbor. And why did they attack Pearl, Private? Because they hate the U.S. of A and our way of life. They attacked the U.S. because we cut off their oil. What would we do if another country denied us the gas to run our cars? I'm learning so much in this game. I'm not a huge know-it-all of war. Uh, I actually didn't know about that about the um, war, World War Two, I think. I don't know. The silk stocking murder. Cool. Ah, oh, Phelps. I was just discussing with Finbar here how well you were doing. I was seeing. Weren't you pissed off at me? Yeah, my real name. Forget all about it. You boys have a new case. A poor Hispanic woman murdered near Oh Hall. no, not Hispanic. Yo, I'm Hispanic. Oh, naked woman, sir? Yeah. That's scary to me. To have had quite a run of them since the came to oh my god. Felt politely trying to hint that he thinks that Mendez was a poke. Well, young folks, you win some and you lose some in police work. You're happy with the Muller case, sir? Over the moon, boys! The DA couldn't be more pleased with the evidence the witness. I'm so confused with this dipshit. Now, get out there and catch me all the Cool! I don't know how people could breathe inside a place with everyone smoking around them back in those days. I would have had asthma already. 
Anyway, um, yeah, let's go ahead and explore this case. Uh, this video is coming to an end now. Like I said, it was gonna be shorter than most of the vehicles, what the, most of the videos that I've done. You're kidding. The next one will be opposite Central Station. Count yourself lucky. Most guys would kill to land a case so close to the Yeah, it means they can pop in to hit the office supply of hooch whenever they need it. No, that ain't a bad idea. That is not a bad idea at all. Cool. What? 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 Right, so I'm really hoping I get a street crime case. Because I really, really need to, um... Let me check if there is one. Because it kind of tells you in advance sometimes. But I guess in this case, it didn't. Great. Oh wait, the case is right there. Sweet! Right, so. Should I take this shortcut? Oh, they're not letting people through there. Nice, that's a cool detail in the video game. This case. Detectives, we're ready to start the show. I'll take you through. And this is a. Oh no, not another naked lady! God damn it! I have to blur all this stuff out. Shit. For Christ's sake. Brothers, Finker. Cause of death is pretty apparent. I have to blur more stuff. So best wait for you when you're ready. Sorry about the barking, by the way. Alright, guys. Time to explore yet another naked lady. This is I, I don't mind these. I just, I when it comes to editing, let me just pause it. When it comes to editing, I have to blur all this stuff out, and it's a lot of work. And for the past few videos, I've had to blur a bunch of stuff. So, without further ado, another naked lady. I forgot about all these naked ladies, by the way. Why don't they pick men instead? It's easier. Wait, why can't I? Okay, let's go ahead and uh, explore her. Oh my god. This one has flies. Holy shit. Kiss the blood, Dee Dee. Kiss the blood, Dee Dee. The fuck? That's some crazy ass stuff. Um, right. Another ring freaking missing are you serious oh another wedding ring god skin under the fingernail oh my god oh i don't buy i don't mind goriness freaking dogs i don't mind goriness but the bone oh no get that out of my screen this was this was over the top Oh. Lacerations on the neck would indicate a great deal of force. Yeah. That looks like Hulk strangled her. My god, she has an F. Was she a teacher or something? She gave a bad grade to one of her students and one of her students wanted to get her back. <gasps> I don't know. I don't remember this case. Oh, what is this? Antonia. to find it that is so weird All right, I think that's it yep the evidence in the Muller case was solid I'm not convinced about Mendon best way to get away with murder is to pin it on somebody else I'll bet a month's salary this is the top of the case strangle batter yeah naked. yeah yeah we know the MO so does every jerk who kills his wife and girlfriend looking for a way out I've spoken to Brown still believes the Dahlia perp has medical experience. Four women, all murdered, all put on display, all with messages. Muller had no medics. Look, Phelps, this is getting us nowhere. Anything for us to go on, Mel? Head injuries from contact with road, bruising from a small man's shoe, further blunt force trauma to the occipital region at the base of the skull. Could have been fatal, but clear signs of strangulation would seem to rule it out. Whoa. Lipstick appears to be a similar color to the other cases. I'll see if I can nail down a brand. Oh, wait. I know why this is all relating. Yeah, it all kind of came together again. And we're going to just stare the other way. Just so I don't have to blur out anymore. 
just gonna say I'm not spoiling anything. I just remember why all of this is going on. Um, I now remember why all these cases are so similar. But uh, again, I'm not gonna spoil anything. There's people who have never played this game. May as well follow the trail. Right, so let's look for clues. Oh god. What is this? A sock! Nice. How can Cole grab that? Ew. I wouldn't grab that if I were a detective. I don't think the guy strangled her with a sock. It would have broken or something. What is this? Oh, right here. Oh. We got some cigarettes. Nothing. And what is this? So soft tissues. What was that guy doing with this lady? Oh my god. Uh okay, okay. Alright, moving on. So you'll want to come and take a look. Right after I ch oh, I see something back there. Um What is this? I'm not kidding, Phil. Come Hold see on. Now. What is this? Uh oh, that's a cup. What the hell? Why am I looking at cups? Anyway, um, let's try not to look at the dead body, so I don't have to do that much blur work. What is this? Oh, a hat. Antonia. Antonia. Oh yeah, back then Antonia people put their names on everything. I don't know why. Nowadays, if you lose something, you lost it. Like nobody's gonna like pick it up and oh this is Antonia let me bring it back to her people most people just keep it <laughs> and there's a trail of course of blood um I don't know all right let's just follow the freaking trail just want to check there is no more clues besides these. Oh, look, a shoe! Oh. M vi 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 the scene, plus the blood stains. No way is this coincidence. I, I don't think back then they had the whole fingerprint artists people. So, like, stuff like this would have been discovered pretty easily because a killer. I'm pretty sure he grabbed all this stuff with his bare hands. Back then, there wasn't any latex gloves, I'm pretty sure. Um, anyway, let's keep following this. I don't think I've ever gotten into this vehicle. I don't think I can get in it. What is this? Oh! Don't tell me it's Oxidol. Most skill. What the hell? That's so weird. Alright, um... Oh, look. And it begins. Ends the heat. Number five. Number five! House keys. Strung up like bait on a hook. Hey Patrick, you know what's funnier than 24? What? 25. <laughs> Who remembers that? Cool. But it yeah, of course he is. Probably all the way to City Hall before he meets up with it. All right, let's see. What is that? Oh, a card. That's got to be. That's Braille. Um, cipher. writing. Wait, how? How? They're detectives. How do they not know that's Braille? So. Yeah. Cool. Um. Oh. Oh, there we go. Stairs. We gotta go up them, obviously. Where are you taking us? 
cool. I love how fast he goes up the stairs. It's kind of like, he looks like a chipmunk or something. So, it, ke it continues. Yeah, it continues. I remember. I, I remember this. Alright, what is this? Another card. Mrs. Antonia Maldonado by hand. And there's nothing in it. Empty. Where is all of this meant to be taking us? I don't know. Clearly wants us to find this place. It's left it for us. Yeah, I mean, like he took a, he go, probably Paul. took like a paintbrush and he like, like brushed her and then brushed it all over this place. That's just. Disgusting. All right, what is that? Uh, makeup box. Yep. Enameled and gold plated. And back it's then, I her. believe gold plated stuff were actually gold. It wasn't paint, so that's really cool. All right, what else? More blood. God damn. It was either that guy with the paintbrush or this bitch was climbing all over that place. Holy shit. Now I remember this case. I know this is... I expected this. Oh, another key. Oh wait, no, that's a ring. Oh god, the finger with the bone. Oh yeah, that, that's... That's gross. That's actually kind of irritating and cringy. Uh, no, no, I cannot. I can't even imagine looking at my own bone in my finger. Oh, no, 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 consola, no. Oh, I knew it was a paintbrush. I knew that bitch was no monkey. No, no. It was impossible for her to climb all over this building with her finger all Looks as though the bony decorating with this yes sir oh wait that's what that was pain that was an actual blood wow party pooper and the purse I don't remember actually finding so many of these things uh, when I originally played this game. Anyway, we got the uh, rest of the library card. North Hill Street, and I've been signed out of PSN. How lovely. And my dog is barking again. That was it? Oh. Yes, and I found all the clues. That's how you roll. Alright, guys, that is also about it for yet another episode of L.A. Noor. So, in the next episode, let's see what's going to be happening. Uh, oh my god, my dog won't shut up. So, we're going to be heading to Antonia's residence in the next episode and continue to find out who the hell is this uh, sick guy ripping out rings and stomping and like obsessed with ropes or something. I don't know. So yeah, thank you for watching, and I hope you guys enjoyed this, and I will see you in the next episode. Malabla Bazus.